I don't creep out very easy. That was slightly creepy. <laughs> We're out taking a joyride. Golf cart totally will not start. Time to have some fun. <laughs> Going through some water. Be very careful because there are snakes all around. So So when you arrive at Bimini, it is a pretty good walk to get into the port area. However, they do have some little train type trams to bring you in. So you just have a little walk until you get to those. So it's not too bad. We're going on a train ride. Toot toot. <laughs> Bimini right now, you with Eminem. This model comes straight out of Bimini, the Bahamas. All right, don't forget about driving on the left hand side. It's the wrong hand side for you guys, okay? <laughs> we out ya. Here we go, off to have some fun. <laughs> okay, so when you're driving in the golf cart across Bimini, as you're going through the streets, it looks a little older and a little rough, but look, just keep going. When you get to the edge of the island, it is an island paradise it is beautiful now you can stop anywhere you want to here on the island there's plenty of places to park and all you have to do is lock up your golf cart go ahead and take this if you would kill yep you put that on here lock it up it's not going anywhere you've got the key you can go in anywhere you want to to shop go to the beach and just have a good time speaking of lock it up babe how's that golf cart driving going <laughs> I have only had to lock it up once here in the first 10 minutes of being at Bimini. Not bad. things along the beach line here at Bimini is there's all kinds of these old ruins that you have here I imagine maybe destroyed just over time but also maybe some hurricanes and things like that you have this complex that goes all the way through this and come over here and check this out you can see this how this had a lower like a basement level and all of this has just collapsed it goes way back in this way and again it extends to the right it extends way back to the left look over this way all kinds of amazing things down through here it's just the kind of thing you don't see every day wow you also get all kinds of sticky things on our feet we got bird i'm gonna be a gentleman and pick off all oh, the stickies get that one right there it's pointing me ow ow <laughs> If you stick me with yeah. that, I'm gonna stick you with that. Oh no. <laughs> Don't let that thing grab your ankle. <laughs> so, I'm walking through this very, very old cemetery. Um, some of these graves have been here for 100 plus years. Um, some of them are fairly new, but Jason was nowhere to be found. And it was slightly scary because 
obviously not been upkept, but sometimes when I would walk, I would step on something really squishy and I'm like, I might just fall in a hole here and nobody would ever find me again. Okay, so Kelly had me come check this out and this is squishy and we were just told to be very careful because there are snakes all around. So look how this is squishing down. Wow. Get out, babe. Save yourself while you still can. I don't creep out very easy. That was slightly creepy. Okay, so Kelly and I, we have a really good relationship. We've been married 22 years and things are going great. And one thing we do is, you know, we take turns doing different things. So right now, it's Kelly's turn to drive. So we'll see how this goes. Let's do this. Let's go, babe. You are an amazing driver. This is gonna be great. I'm just gonna sit back. No worries at all. You better buckle your seatbelt. <laughs> Guess I better turn it on first. <laughs> it's our, yeah. We're good. Now let's go buckle your seatbelt. <laughs> Wait, is it? No, that, that's the brake. That's the gas right there. <laughs> Oh, here we go! <laughs> now one thing I would recommend here at Bimini is to make sure that you're bringing some tennis shoes or some good walking shoes. Even out on the beaches, you've got some of the hard shell rock. So if you really don't have good shoes, I mean, it could... You're not going to be feeling the squishy sand squish <laughs> between your feet on every one of the beaches. Some of the beaches here, but not everyone. Bring some good shoes. Okay, so as you're driving along, if you see some shopping or something you want to stop at, it's so easy. You pull over. You park, you lock up your golf cart, grab your stuff, go look around for as long as you want. What's up. happening, Kel? <laughs> We're out taking a joyride. Golf cart totally will not start. We, we just stopped on the side of the road. Second time this has happened. <laughs> <laughs> Number two. We were so, looking at a shot to see if we got a shot. So Kelly and is practicing her emergency mechanic <laughs> recovery skills, trying to get that Boy Scout badge. All right, I'm not sure what this means either. It's like... It just means I ain't got no power. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. I heard something. Yeah. It was like it wanted to go, but it didn't. Oh. 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 oh! Bam! <laughs> Mechanic badge to Kelly. Okay, so this sort of reminds me of that old Will Smith song, Parents Just Don't Understand. Do you remember that one? I think so, yeah. Something like, I put my hand on our knee. I put my foot on the gas. We almost got whipped last. We, we took, took off, off so fast. fast. Just a note. We have not been drinking. We are always this crazy. <laughs> True. Okay, so we think we have spotted the place to be on Bimini. It is here at the public beach here when you go to the left side as you're coming off the port. So our recommendation would be to go to the right side, check out the natural area of Bimini, and then come back here to the far left side. This is an amazing beach spot. Actually, this ranks up there with any other spot in the Bahamas. And one of the amazing things you many times will have 
is a lot of time here at Bimini. We have till 6 p.m. tonight. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna go back to the ship. Yep, and we are actually going to time it to see how long it takes to get from the public beach to get onto the ship. And we're gonna go back there. It's about 12.30 to one o'clock. We're gonna go back there and eat. So it costs us nothing. We'll get some free Guy's Burgers or Blue Iguana. We're gonna drive back here and then we're gonna spend the rest of the day at the beach. Now here's one of the cool things. You can pull your golf cart up and you can park it up there real close to the ship. So let's see, go! We're gonna see how far they'll let us drive. Come on! And we're off! So it was a three minute drive from the beach area to the port area and now we are standing here we are waiting for the tram to come by to take us all the way to the ship so we're going to flag them down and say we need a ride for that last couple hundred feet. And that's mainly just because we're just too lazy just to walk it. Pretty you know, much, yeah. We're going to save the legs, wait yeah. here for the tram. Yeah. 